Hi guys and welcome back to another nail video. Today I'm working on Bella and I am going to be doing, I don't know if you guys remember, but we did do a sculpting and tips on bitten nails and this is the result of the nails from that. I have got chit chat on here from Kiara Sky and you can get that from nailtechnetwork.co.uk and this is the queen of decals which you can you can also get these from Nail Tech Network. I'm using a Mia Secret luxury top coat and that is what I'm going to use to keep the sticky layer and basically to stick these decals onto. I'm really sorry if you can hear my crying kitten in the background. She's in the next room and she wants her mummy so I'm going to be going to see her when I finish this but yeah she's just having a little meow. So all I'm doing to start off with is just applying the top coat to all of the nails. So yeah, Bev from Queen of Decals has got so many different uh, decals basically. This is the one stroke and this is a collaboration. And I think there are three pages to this, so I would definitely go and check them out. I will. The link to Nail Tech Network is down below, and you'll be able to find them on there. You can also get them from Bev herself, and she's on Instagram and Facebook, and it is Queen of Decals. So I cured and then had a nice sticky layer and that is what I'm going to use to put these decals into. Basically all I did was cut around them as close to the picture as I could and then pop it in water for like 10 seconds or so and then pull it off. I like to use tweezers to apply. I was actually lucky enough to meet Bev at the weekend and she gave me some tips she doesn't use tweezers when she applies them, but for, for me, I just find it's easier to see what I'm doing, and I'm just, it's easier for me that way. So, one tip, as you can see here, the picture hung over a little bit over the edge. You do not want that to happen. That will not make the decals look good. So, you want to make sure that you cut it to the right size, and then get it all stuck on. And I'm basically just going to move on to the next one. Obviously, as you can see, it just looks like some nice hand painted one stroke flowers. I love it. They're so, so pretty. So I'm, yeah, basically the same technique throughout it all. Cut your picture out, place it in some water for 10, 20 seconds, pull it out. You can just slide the back in off of that and then place it where you want it. So on this nail, I did decide to use the Queen of Decals logo, which is on all of the sheets of paper. I just thought it would add a nice cute little touch and that's what I decided to do. So I'm just going to let you guys watch me apply the rest of the decals and then I'll be back.
You just want to make sure that you press it in and try and get all of the edges pressed right down and that is when it will look the most real and the most kind of like hand painted rather than stuck on. If that makes sense. So I'm then going to take my my blue sky, I nearly said Chiara sky then, I'm going to take my blue sky no wipe top coat and I'm just going to top coat all of the nails as usual, just making sure that I really get it all covered and that there are no no parts of it that are not covered. If you're doing this on yourself or on a client or whatever, you're probably going to be best to do two top coats because I was doing this on a pooch's hand and these nails are just going to be coming straight off. I just did the one, but yeah, I, I would say probably maybe do two just to make sure it's really protected. And that is it. If you are interested, please do go check out the Queen of Decal on Instagram. You can see loads more pictures of her awesome decals. She's got a lot of Disney ones and themed ones. So yeah, definitely would advise. I love them. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. This is the finished look and I just love these decals. I'm going to be using them a lot more in videos, so keep an eye out. If you're not already subscribed, please do hit the subscribe button and join this little family. You can hit the bell button as well so you can get notifications when I upload. And that is it, you guys. I love you so, so much and your support means everything. I will see you in the next video. Bye!